thank you for those readings tonight. Um, I thought, you know, Mrs. Eddy's chapter on prayer is a, is a masterpiece. I know I, I heard someone recently in, in need of a healing, and the prayer that was given was, was one of, of pleading to God to please help me, please save me. And I know at one time in my life that was certainly my sense of prayer as well. But when you really read and study Mrs. Eddy's chapter on prayer, you see the right prayer, the prayer that Jesus prayed. She says they were uh, conscientious protestations of truth. Um, It's the prayer of affirmation. It is knowing God's presence and power ever with us. It is knowing this week's lesson is about the, the first creation, that God saw everything that he had made, and behold, it was very good. This is the prayer. It's the prayer of thanksgiving, uh, the gratitude for all the good that he has done and all the good that he is giving us right here and right now. This kind of prayer is what raises your thought. It what ra- it's raises your thought to see what God has already done And as was read tonight, uh, that we don't have to reach out in vain to him. He's always with us, and he answers every prayer uh, when it is this, this kind of recognition of all that he is, all that he always will be. I'm so grateful to Mrs. Eddy and for our textbook. Uh, She so lovingly and explicitly explains the truth of our being including how to pray right so that that we can feel our Father's presence and power with us. And that is what results in healing. So grateful to be here tonight and to have heard all the wonderful testimonies and the beautiful readings and the beautiful music. Thank you.